Welcome back to the White House Farm. And uh, what we're gonna be doing today, we're gonna be doing a, a tune-up on the Mercruiser engine. We're gonna do spark plugs, oil change, uh, spark plug wires, uh, points, rotor, cap, and condenser. So let's go ahead and get into it and start getting that done. So let's go ahead and start to remove the spark plug wires and the spark plugs. Okay, so here's the numbers for the spark plugs we're gonna be replacing. All right, so here's our four new spark plugs, BR6FS. So let's go ahead and set up our cap with the new spark plug wires. And this is the new cap number. All right. So. I can take this guy off right here. That's our coil. And here's the new spark plug wire set. And there's the part number. There's all of our new wires. This goes on the coil. That one's gonna go over there. So we'll set that off to the side for now. All right. So, those two are about the same, and these two are. So, here's our new one. So, we're going to go ahead and get this down in there. There you go, hear it snap in. So that one's in there. Let's go ahead and put the little rubber boot over it. And then we'll put the other one. Put the other one in this one. That snapped right in. And cover it with the boot. And then we got our two long ones here. And we'll put that in there. Snap it in, cover it with the boot. Same thing here. Snap it right into there. And then cover it with the boot. And then the center one, that's for our coil, so we're gonna snap that one in. go and then cover that with the boot there we go so now this is all set up to where 
we'll be able to just put this one right back on there. And you see the order that they're in. So this one's gonna go in the number one there, the number two. So this one's gonna go in the first one, this one's gonna go in the second one, and then this back, back one's gonna go here, and then that one's gonna go there. Always take pictures and stuff, that way you know where stuff goes. And the, the firing order for this is one, three, four, two. So it's a one, three, four, two firing order. So let's go ahead and get these off. And we can remove this whole thing. And you can save that to put together your other two. So there's the old one. Put the little bracket on there for those two. Now here's your your rotor. A little bit of schmutz on there. That came right off. All too bad. But we got a brand new kit to put on. Although I just noticed that the rotor on there is smashed to bits, so that kind of stinks. So looks like we'll be using this one again. Don't look too bad, luckily. Go figure. And that's the part number for it. Get the one without the broken rotor. <laughs> that's your condenser. And this is just gonna slide right on this like that and then we got to take that off right there a little flat head there's a little flat head and this should just come right off Move that off to the side, and you can put the new one on. All right, so there's like a little clip here. You gotta squeeze these in to get that piece off. Go ahead and disconnect these wires. right out that wire comes right out and now we got to take the points off Okay, so we got that flat head out. Now our points should come right off of here. See? All right, so now that we got that off, here's our new points. And 
and just gotta unscrew this. Just unscrew it enough just, just so you can get those two wires on there. There's one. Let's go ahead and get that flat head back in there. You can see the old points were kind of beat up and they were starting to go. Okay, get our condenser on here. Get our condenser on here. Okay, that's on there nice and tight. And let's get this other wire in here for the condenser. Okay. We got those in there good. Move this out of the way. We'll go ahead and tighten that up now. And now we need to adjust our points. Um, it should be gapped between um, point zero, uh, one eight and point zero, uh, two three. Point zero two two is the ideal gap for these. So make sure you have your, your gapper. And so we're going to have to loosen this up a little. And adjust it. Now it's gapped. Okay, so let's go ahead and remove all those spark plugs. And we're using a 5 ace to remove them. The 
first one. There's the second one. There's number three. And there's the number four. All right, so here's our new ones. And they should be gapped around 0 0.045 for the new ones. They come pre-gapped, but always double check them. And now we're gonna tighten them up just a little bit. If you wanna over tighten these. That's good. That's good. That's good. And that's good. All right. So now we can take our new cap and plugs and put this on here. And remember we had the two shorties back here just like this so it's gonna go on here just like that and we'll go ahead and tighten it up Remember this spark plug wire is the number one here. Snap it on there. You put your one back in your coil here. Make sure the boots are on all the way. And then here's the number two here. snap on and then number three which is going to be this one right here that's going to go on that one that snaps in and then finally your number four all the way at the end here All right, so we got the new cap rotor points and condenser on, the new spark plug wires, got the oil change done. That's all set. Uh, last thing to do is go ahead and test it out, uh, fire it up and get her going. Okay, moment of truth. Before I even started, I see there's a, a little bit of a gas le leak in here. Let me go ahead and fix that. Okay, so I fixed the leak there. Just had to tighten this up a little bit more. So, looks good now. Um, don't notice anything else. Looks good down here. No leaks. Everything's together. All right, so let's fire it up and cross our fingers here. So, 
gauges are coming on and one two three all right that sucker fired right up Double check, make sure nothing's leaking. Feeling good there now. Sounds good. Alright. It's got a good idle to it too. Nothing leaking. give her a little juice So she's all back together. Got the cap rotor points, condenser, new spark plugs, new spark plug wires. Got them all gapped. Um, got the oil change done, new oil filter. We're all set. Next thing to do is just go enjoy the lake. So I'm looking forward to it. I've been sweating all day and <laughs> this will be nice. So we're gonna get going here. So hope you guys like, enjoy, subscribe as usual, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. You can't say goodbye without saying goodbye to me. All right, Olaf, we'll see you on the next one. All right, bye, Obo. Bye, guys.